John Valiant, an American author and journalist based in Vancouver, delves into the gripping narrative of The Tiger, A True Story of Vengeance and Survival, 2010. This non-fiction work recounts the chilling tale of a man-eating tiger that terrorized Russia's Far Eastern Primorye region during the late 1990s. In addition to unraveling the harrowing events involving the tiger and its victims, Valiant intricately weaves in the recent history of the region, exploring both the scientific understanding and traditional superstition surrounding the Siberian tiger. Furthermore, he addresses the environmental challenges that jeopardize the continued existence of this majestic species. Renowned for his contributions to publications such as The New Yorker, The Atlantic, and National Geographic, Valiant gained prominence with his 2005 nonfiction book, The Golden Spruce, a recipient of the Canadian Governor General's Award. The narrative unfolds with the discovery of the lifeless body of Vladimir Markov, an adept woodsman and hunter, outside his dwelling. The evidence signs of a tiger attack puzzle local investigators, as Amor tigers native to the Primorai region seldom assault humans without provocation, an action Markov, with his considerable experience, would unlikely have incited. Authorities from the state's wildlife organization intervened to probe the incident, drawing upon contemporary scientific insights into Amor tigers and age-old folk beliefs about the formidable creature. Valiant introduces readers to the expansive and sparsely populated Primorai region in the eastern part of Russia, roughly the size of Washington state. Despite the region's economic struggles following the collapse of communism, it boasts exceptional biodiversity, with the convergence of four distinct bioregions, including the dense Siberian forest, taiga, Mongolian steppelands, subtropical jungles, and the boreal forests of the Arctic Circle. In an attempt to comprehensively depict Primary's botanical richness, scientists have labeled the area the Transbaikalian province of the Circumboreal region. The Amur River, the world's longest undammed river, meanders through this region. Primary's diverse wildlife encompasses the menacing dole, a canid species related to the wolf known to prey on humans. However, the true monarch of the ecologically unique boreal jungle is the Amur tiger the only surviving tiger subspecies adapted to endure arctic conditions while thriving in jungles and various climates in between. Notably, the Amur tiger surpasses its more familiar tropical counterparts in size. The Amur tiger possesses a notably robust skull, with the head of a fully grown male rivaling the width of a human's chest and shoulders. These majestic creatures can reach a length of 9 feet, standing over 3 feet tall at the shoulder. Their formidable fangs match the length of an adult man's forefinger, and their paws are as expansive as dinner plates. Dominating the apex predator role in the Primorai, Amur tigers keep the wolf population in check by preying on them, along with bears. According to Valiant, the Amur tiger embodies the fusion of a cat's agility and appetites with the mass of an industrial refrigerator. Having set the stage with a portrayal of the region and its formidable tigers, Valiant shifts focus to the deceased Markov. The Wildlife Agency's investigation reveals that Markov unintentionally provoked the tiger by pilfering meat from a boar it had killed. Disturbingly, evidence suggests that the tiger strategically sought revenge by hunting down Markov. Following Markov's funeral, Valiant details the story's progression as Andrei Pachepnya, a friend of the deceased, ventures alone into the taiga. Days pass with no trace of Andrei, prompting a search party. The search yields only blood-soaked clothing, a watch, a crucifix, and a scant amount of human remains that could fit into a shirt pocket. Valiant skillfully delves into the tiger's perspective, envisioning the creature's thoughts as it stakes out Markov's cabin, relishing the comfort of his mattress while awaiting the next victim. The narrative takes a pivotal turn as Yuri Trush, head of the region's Tiger Preservation Agency, assumes the task of tracking and eliminating the tiger. Leveraging professional expertise and local folklore, Trush engages in a climactic confrontation with the tiger, risking his own life. The book concludes with Trush's remarkable response, unsure whether it stemmed from shock or extraordinary composure, as his first instinct after the encounter is to document it on film. The tiger not only explores humanity's intricate relationship with the natural world, but also highlights the dire ecological consequences of human activities. Drawing inspiration from animal chase narratives like Moby Dick and Jaws, Valiant crafts a compelling portrait of the charismatic and powerful Amor tiger. I hope you enjoyed this video, leave a like if you did, and be sure to subscribe thank you.